Hello, I'm Dr. John McDougall. There is a recent discovery of a burial plot, <clears throat> about 200 square foot burial plot in Ephesus, which is uh, where Turkey is now. And when they dug up that burial plot, they found that it was inhabited by 60 men. And these men, they were found to be gladiators because of the swords and shields and tridents and the trident holes in their skulls. These were gladiators. And they analyzed the bones of these gladiators that had been buried since uh, uh, 1800 years ago, they were buried. <clears throat> and what they found is uh, based upon their bone analysis is that their diet was vegan, yes. And that fits with the historical accounts of gladiators. They called them the barley men because their diet was basically barley with a few beans. Now, why did they eat barley? Oh, because they wanted to win. I mean, losing in the Colosseum was a really bad scene. So they wanted to win. They knew about endurance. They knew about strength and they knew how to get it. And that was from eating barley and other grains and legumes and not eating the meat that the people in the audience of the Colosseum may have been eating. So you can take that same bit of advice if you want to be strong, you want to endure, you want to beat the competition, whether it's physical, mental, or emotional. You want to be fueled properly, and that's not with a diet of meat or dairy products. That's with a starch-based diet with fruits and vegetables. You be a barley man or a barley woman. You'll enjoy the difference, and people will notice I'm Dr. John McDougall. Thanks for listening.